so i did my dragon ball legend sixth anniversary predictions that you can check out in the video on the top right corner of the screen and in the pin comment and description but now it's time to hear what you guys think is coming because i put out a community post asking you for your sixth anniversary predictions and i love doing videos like this community response videos are kind of my favorite types of videos to do because it's very laid back and i get to connect to you on a more deep level so if you enjoy videos like this be sure that you hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for all the sixth anniversary news and updates and let's move on with the first comment which says this person here says part one will probably be something bull saga related or an and slash or god key part two will be legends original or movies part three will be ultra gogeta 4 and that kind of lines up with what i think is coming out for the sixth anniversary i think that it's very likely that we are going to get some new super vegeto because we did get that hint that i broke down in another video that you can see on the channel where i basically dived into it and i deduced that we are getting something Boo saga related for at least the first part of the anniversary and then a lot of people are saying that they want a new lf god coast or maybe legends gonna hear their cries and you know throw them a bone they did drop a new teaser trailer on their social media accounts like a few hours ago as of the time of recording and you know it was pretty ambiguous i couldn't see much to go by in that video besides the coloring of the video was kind of similar to super saiyan god i think and then okay part two legends original or movies movies is always the safe bet for these celebrations like especially in recent times from like the third anniversary i would say they always heavily relied on movies and legends festival 2020 even before the third anniversary movies was a big carrier in that as for legends original i feel like they might not do legends originals very often maybe it'll be a legends fest exclusive thing but we'll wait and see hopefully though they do change up the banner formats for that and part three will be ultra gogeta 4 i think that's universally agreed upon if it's not ultra gogeta 4 i'll be very surprised and i don't know what else they could do maybe an ultra super saiyan 4 goku or ultra mui goku ultra beast gohan maybe i don't know but i think that ultra gogeta 4 is the move for this anniversary next comment says i think in the first part first ever manga characters second part collaboration with super dragon ball heroes third part double ultra banners maybe ultra gogeta 4 and ultra fuse Masu. that is pretty you know what i like predictions like this that are out there even though they might not be possible i just like the fact that some people will say something different other than the actual usual suspects you know but as for the manga characters i don't think that we'll ever get manga characters in the video games as long as they aren't animated i did do a video talking about that where i basically said that uh dragon ball sparking zero previously known as budokai tenkai hg4 that game will not have uh dbs manga characters because of that reason second part collaboration with heroes i don't think that it is possible i think they have to, correct me if i'm wrong but i think they have to kind of pay to use the rights to the heroes characters if i'm if i'm not mistaken i could be wrong on that and i think heroes ended so like i don't know how much support heroes will have nowadays but it would be cool though i mean it's a whole new roster of forms and characters to play around with so maybe when times get desperate maybe they will reach into heroes but i don't think now is the time for that third part double ultra banners i don't think that they will do a double ultra banner maybe unless they change up the format then i can see it but other than that i don't think so but ultra gogeta 4 i just went into that ultra fuse zamasu i don't know if fuse zamasu is enough of a money maker for him to warrant being an anniversary ultra but we'll see maybe if they like put two ultras on one panel or something like that i don't know maybe 
then it could work. But other than that, I can't see Ultra Fuse Zamasu being a thing, at least during the anniversary. After the anniversary, definitely, sure. But not during the anniversary. Okay, this next person says... Part 1, SSG, Goku and Vegeta tag unit revive into SSB, Gogeta. That's cool. Fuse Zamasu revive into Corrupt Zamasu. Ultra Gogeta 4 slash Ultra Fuse Zamasu. Super Saiyan God, Goku and Vegeta tag unit. That would be interesting. I don't think they teamed up as Super Saiyan God though. So like, I don't know if that would be possible. But it would still be fun. And reviving into Gogeta, that's also cool. Gogeta Blue is like probably the best looking fusion warrior out there in terms of animations and style and fighting style you know like the dps probably movie as a whole so like i always get excited when they add new stuff from that movie in the game part two fuse zamasu revive into corrupted zamasu i could see this being side by side with another unit maybe not a headliner for a part but maybe on a dual step up, I could see one banner being someone and then the other banner can be this guy. Because like, I think that we do need another few Zamasu. It's been a while. Or maybe they could Zenkai the old LF Red Zamasu. So I'd like this. And then part 3, I went into this Ultra Gogeta 4 slash Ultra Fuse Zamasu. I don't think Zamasu is coming honestly. Like Ultra Fuse Zamasu, I don't think so. But Ultra Gogeta 4 is the top candidate, I would say. Next comment says, Part 1, Sparking... Wait, uh, Sparking LL Tag, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku and Vegeta, they can fuse into Vegito, and Sparking LL, Super Saiyan God Goku. That was basically what the popular consensus is. That's basically what the word on the streets is now. That's basically what everyone wants, or... Similar to what everyone wants, so yeah. Part 2, Zenkai Awaken, Yellow Gogeta Blue and Sparking LL Kefla, they can transform. Definitely yes on the Gogeta Blue Zenkai, I did do another video talking about 5 LF characters that desperately need a Zenkai and he was definitely on that list. Sparking LL Kefla, I don't think that she's she carries enough weight to be an anniversary LF, but maybe I could be wrong. But I would definitely like to see a Legends Limited Kefla down the line. And then the last part 3 says Ultra Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta with Sparking LL Nova and Ice Shenron Tag. Okay, Gogeta 4, I've beaten that like a dead drum. Yes, please, I want Gogeta 4 Ultra, definitely. Nova and Nova and Ice tag units would be an interesting choice, like if because like they aren't really an exciting unit on their own like if they were on their own banner i don't think people would particularly summon on that very much because you know during the third anniversary they won super saiyan 4 go cheetahs banner and no one really cared about them and they got replaced pretty quickly by super saiyan 3 goku and oop but if they did put him on a banner this tag unit on a panel with a unit that is very hype like Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta again. Then people will like I unironically start to like them. Maybe they'll start using them. But Nova and uh, Ice Shenron definitely as a tag unit would be very cool. I would say. Okay this. Next person says if the Ultra isn't Gogeta 4 we riot. I 100% agree with that. This person here says Ultra MUI Goku. That's... That's actually very possible in my opinion because if you go back to Legends Festival 2023 everyone thought that we were going to get the Ultra Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta there until they decided to leak the Ultra UI sign Goku and then they dropped him and then people were like what the heck because you know that is basically a Sun Family centric festival universe reps got so many buffs during that year it was just insane so now imagine we expecting super saiyan 4 gogeta again and then they hit us with the swerve again and they just decide to drop ultra mui instead i wouldn't be disappointed because i love mui but i want gogeta 4 give it to me man and this person agrees with me they say ultra gss 4 definitely Give me the Gogeta right now. 
and then this next one says for me ultra legends limited god goku i mean sorry i think legends limited god goku legends limited kefla ultra black freeza that's an interesting one or ultra super saiyan 4 goku okay let's break that down god goku a lot of people want that no problem there kefla i also went into that i don't think that she's good enough to be an anniversary ll but definitely down the line yes ultra black freezer i don't think was will come be- for reasons that i mentioned previously i don't think that they're gonna animate the manga characters so if they don't animate the manga characters they won't be in the game because i think that you know it's a different right deal and stuff like that ultra super saiyan 4 goku is a very valid candidate i would say if it's not gogeta 4 because you know if we get a super vegeta for example i don't think that they would want to buff fusions so crazily or maybe they would and then they'll just never touch their team again until december but ultra super saiyan 4 goku is a good alternative option as an anniversary ultra in my opinion then finally this last person says no i don't want ultra ssj4 gogeta like why wouldn't you want him do you want like I don't know, Ultra Beast Gohan or something to come break the game again alongside Ultra Super Saiyan 2. Come on, man. But yeah, those were your comments and predictions on the Dragon Ball Legends 6th anniversary. Let me know if you missed out on this post. Let me know what you guys think and click another video on screen. I'll see you there. Peace, like and subscribe.